25th of January 2017. This is a special afternoon version of Cinema Cycle because when I woke up this morning at 4 a.m. it was like 24 degrees outside which means the man cave would have been about 42 degrees and I was under a warm electric blanket and it just wasn't gonna happen. So here I am in the afternoon and I come out to find out that the computer tells me to watch yeah, Chi Chen Chong's Still Smokin'. There's the actual album cover, slip cover, laser disc cover. Um, have not seen this, but I just, I think I'm in for a treat, okay? <laughs> this ought to be good. Okay, I'm gonna kind of close out here. Uh, the, the film is still running. We haven't got to the credits yet, but it's, it doesn't really matter because uh, it, it's just uh, turned into basically a, a concert performance film. Uh, an interesting film, not, not a very good film, obviously, for uh, several reasons that I wouldn't have expected. Um, this is basically just a skit film. This is one skit after another, uh, most likely part of their stand-up comedy act that they used to have back in the 60s and 70s. Uh, it's all strung together with a loose theme of them being uh, mistaken for someone else and just wandering from flashback scene to fantasy scene to flashback scene to where there really is no plot. They're just leading to different situations that are obviously their skits. So it's all just tied together loosely, a bunch of skits. Um, that said, you know, these guys are actually good. You, you don't really think about it in their stoner persona. Uh, but, you know, this is all done by them, it's produced by them and written by them. It's directed by uh, Tommy Chong. And some of the scenes, you know, they're obviously just trying to bring forth uh, acting and emotion. And some of it's almost actually dramatic in sections where you almost kind of like, this really isn't a funny stoner film, this is like almost Hamlet. And then it goes to something else. So, uh, you know, it's interesting to see them. Uh, it's basically home movies done very well with camera dollies and microphones and lighting. Uh, would have been fun to do back in the 70s and 80s, I guess. <laughs> but it's more interesting for, for an, an historical film to see how perceptions have changed, how comedy has changed, uh, things such as that. Uh, as an entertaining film to watch, not so much.